Hey Aries, my name is Crystal. I'm going to find out what's coming in for you guys for love. Sudden wealth. Okay, I just did a reading and that popped up. Maybe you guys might be coming into some type of money or a man. Or, or it says mature man. So there might be a man that's coming in for you that has a lot of money. Okay, so somebody who's rich or just somebody has a very good job, right? This is a love reading. So, um, And then privileged lady. Holy shit imprisonment okay so maybe <laughs> i don't know what that means maybe somebody you know is going to jail or you might be dealing with some type of court legal situations or maybe they are maybe they work in a jail i don't know but then you have privileged lady mature man sudden wealth um so i feel like this person that's coming in for you three of pentacles somebody that you can build together with somebody that you might work with okay but i feel like this person's going to take care of you um privileged lady so i feel like they are definitely somebody who's going to be taking care of you look ace of pentacles this person may have their own business they may have their um just like a lot of money or maybe they've came into like you know maybe like some type of air or how you want to call that um I don't know, but they, I feel like this person that's coming in, Three of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Sudden Wealth, Privileged Lady, like this person's got a lot of money that's coming in for you. Okay, the Page of Swords, this person might be watching you, spying on you, watching your, um, you know, social media and stuff like that. Um, and then the Eight of Pentacles, like I said, there's a lot of money within this reading. This person's either somebody that's very hard at work or there's somebody that is very focused on their money and that, like, money rolls, like, <laughs> okay, so this person's very focused on, like, what they want in life. So this person's a very hard worker. This person's watching you. They may have their own business and they want to restart something with you. They also may work for the community with the Three of Pentacles. That's, like, a community card working for like the the people or whatever the knight of swords i feel like this person wants to come in fast okay but they might be thinking about it first with the knight of swords it's like you got to think very uh, logically about this because you want to make sure what you're jumping into is going to be something that's going to be worth it right okay so you got the judgment card this person um may um deal with the law or may um just be somebody who's very um you know has a lot of power is what I'm thinking. This person has a lot of power, right? And then you have the Six of Wands. This person uh, might be somebody who's publicly recognized, or maybe you are. Maybe you are standing out in the crowd, right? Maybe uh, you do work on social media or something like that. Maybe that's the reason why they are watching you. But um, let's see what else is coming in. No, let's see the challenge. The Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords is about a truth. It's about promotions. It's about like um, moving up. So this is a challenge right now. So maybe they're having a hard time speaking up, a hard time, you know, coming together with something or, or to to speak their truth. You got the twin. Oh my God, the Four of Wands and then the King of Wands. I feel like this. You guys might be twin flame connection right here, right? But I feel like right now there is a separation that is kind of like, and it's hard for this person to king of wands and the ace of swords to speak up on how they feel about the situation maybe out of fear of not knowing how you guys feel or maybe out of the fear of them leaving you in the past or whatever i don't know this can be somebody who is like flighty and walked out of your life but it doesn't have to be but i feel like this person's watching you all right so you might know this person um you have the strength card and then the two of swords in the past, I feel like somebody made a decision that wasn't very easy for them. Okay, so then maybe this person did walk away in the past. For you. The page of cups, the world, the seven of swords, yeah, and then the five of cups. Regretting not... Um, the Seven of Swords and the Five of Cups is about like regret, maybe because they ran away from their problems, maybe they ran away from commitment, communication, they didn't speak about it, like be being very sneaky, maybe this person um, had multiple people, Look, you got the Nine of Wands underneath of that. I feel like this person has been hurt in the past, right? Maybe didn't have such good relationships within family, relationships, friends, and stuff like that, so maybe they're very guarded, and so every time maybe they, you know, get a... a a taste of love it's like maybe they run right and maybe with the four of wands being your challenge maybe they're having a hard time recognizing um like what type of connection this is or why they're feeling so strongly connected to you but i feel like they're definitely watching you and watching what you're doing um watching your work and then you have the world and then you have the page of cups so i feel like in the past you know there was an offer but it ended right so in your future what's coming up the Ten of Wands, which is the end of burdens, putting all these burdens down to move forward and start something better. Okay, that's ending something so a new beginning can start. Um, you have the Four of Pentacles, the Sun, the Seven of Cups, and the Ace of Cups. Okay, so I do feel like somebody's holding on to something that isn't serving them anymore, whether this is hurt, pain, um, 
you know, another person or whatever this is, but I feel like this person is holding on to or you're holding on to something that is no longer serving you, which is keeping you blocked. But I feel like those burdens are about to be put down. You have the Ace of Cups, the Sun, and the Seven of Cups. This person, in the future, I feel like there is going to be an offer that's going to come in for you guys, but you guys might be a little confused as if, if you should take it, maybe because of what they've done in the past, right? So I feel like um, as long as you guys focus on the positivity and focus on yourself and just heal yourself and do what you got to do, I feel like when the time comes, as long as you listen to your intuition, you'll be able to make the right decision, right? Actions and advice. The Ten of Pentacles. The, the Ten of Pentacles and the Lover's card. <laughs> okay. So actions and advice is to take care of yourself. Love yourself. Nurture yourself. Nurture your, you know, take care of what it is that you're trying to do for you. Um, like So I feel like you're concentrated and focused on your money as well, just like this person is, right? And it's like you got a lot of stuff going on for you right now. So I feel like this is just saying focus on, you know, pure love and happiness and setting out high vibrations, you know, staying positive and just looking forward to, like, what's to come next, you, you know. Um, Ten of Pentacles, is all, tens are about ending, so you do have two tens here. So I do feel like things are ending for you guys um and after this ends that six of swords somebody's going to be moving away from something um that isn't serving them anymore they're mentally detaching and leaving the excess baggage in the past the outcome the death card which is a brand new start right the sun's going to shine again it could be a scorpio gemini uh leo let's see all the signs leo came out twice yeah, that's all the signs I'm seeing for right now. Scorpio, Gemini, Leo, twice, and yeah. But for your outcome, you have the Seven of Wands and the Page of Pentacles. I feel like this is saying set up healthy boundaries around yourself, but don't set them too high to where nobody else can reach you, right? So it's like just make sure that the boundaries that you're setting are healthy ones. Like say, you know, okay, I want you to treat me this way, and I want you to, you know, I want things to go down this way, and you know what I expect it this way, and blah, 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 whatever. And then you have the Page of Pentacles, which is telling me learning to... to to do things in a new way. You got a lot of pentacles in this reading. A lot of pentacles in this reading. Pentacles are about grounding and stable. And so I feel like the offer that's coming in for you is going to be something that's going to be very grounding and stable for you guys. Something um, with a lot of money too. I feel like you guys are going to be financially set um, as well. But the page of pentacles is like maybe learning new things. Uh, what else is coming for you guys in the future? The chariot for movement towards success. Um, I'm not taking all those. The King of Pentacles, Jesus. And then the Five of Wands. So, like I said, when this person comes in, and then the Six of Cups. Nice. So, I feel like when this person comes in, you're going to be a little, like, on the defensive side. Like, not sure if you want this person to come back. Or maybe it might even be somebody that you don't know, right? And But this person's going to come in, and because of the stuff you've been through in the past, you're going to be a little guarded. That's okay, but just make sure that you're... you're Guards are not so high that nobody can get in, okay? But I feel like with the Six of Cups and the Five, I mean, and the King of Pentacles and the Chariot, this person's coming in and um, they want to offer you something stable. They want another chance or they want a chance with you because they're watching you. They see that you're a very hard worker. You see that you're very determined. They see that they can work with you guys, okay? So I'm going to pull some of my Oracle cards, see what's popping up for you guys as well. You got exchanging, no, new life, new life. Ooh. Okay, so new life, building blocks. They want to rebuild with you. This person maybe is like building their own home. Then you have never ending story, or you could be, it doesn't, you don't have to be the never ending story. So I feel like there's a new life coming after this never ending story, and this life is going to be a blessed one. Okay, the angels are trying to guide you guys together. That way you guys can, you know, make things work. But you guys just have to, um, you know, I feel like, uh, I don't know. But anyway, that's what I got for you guys. <laughs> Have a good day. Thank you for watching. Toodles.